Tonight, Johnson County parents confront their superintendent about a controversial proposal that would force some students to transfer out of overcrowded schools. Garrett Hake is live at Briarwood Elementary in Prairie Village, one of the schools impacted by this idea. Garrett. The Shawnee Mission School superintendent says classes here at this school are as crowded as, uh, crowded as they've been in nearly 20 years. There's a new proposal on the table to cut those class sizes by forcing some students to attend other schools. Tonight, that's not sitting well with some parents who say they've been kept in the dark. My family has owned property here, worked here, paid taxes here, and voted here since the 1950s. And we will not accept this proposal. Parent Emily Phillips told the Shawnee Mission School Board in no uncertain terms her feelings about a proposal to reduce overcrowding at two district elementary schools by forcing some students to transfer. And we will continue to make our voices heard as long as the threat of removing our children from Briarwood continues. Thank you. Shawnee Mission Superintendent Jim Hinson said several options are still in discussion over who would have to transfer from Briarwood and Brook Ridge, the other overcrowded school. He deflected responsibility for what some parents have called poor communication onto the site councils made up of parents and school officials. My question to the site council is show me the com your communication out to the parents to see if that's been occurring appropriately. As soon as our interview finished, Hinson faced an even tougher grilling. So do that. Start the paperwork. From more than a dozen angry parents who waited him out to express their frustration that their children might not get to say in the same school next year. I've got an incoming kindergarten, kindergarten next year. And how do I tell her that oh, you're not going to school there next year? Tomorrow night, Henson will meet with this site council at Brook Ridge to discuss the options there. He says tonight only two things are certain in this process. They have to address this overcrowding problem and that someone won't be happy with how it's done. Reporting live in Prairie Village, Garrett Hake, 41 Action News.